All right, guys, we're playing some Nessus top lane, and I'm going to teach you guys exactly on how you guys can play this champion right now. So what you want to run is Fleet, Triumph, Tenacity, Lascent, Biscuits, and Cosmic, and then we also have Ghost along with TP. This game, we're playing Nessus into a Gangplank. Honestly, a pretty good matchup. Like, I can farm it for free. I have zero issues in this matchup. Also, I'm very happy it is a Gangplank because I thought it was going to be a Chin Top. Turns out it's a Gangplank. Either way, this matchup is really good. Um, Gangplank does have the early game. He beats me in the pre-6. Um, but after level 6, the further we progress in this game, the harder we're going to win. I'll show you why. Like, we will stomp him really hard once we get, like, level 6 and a couple items. The little strategy what we're going to do here is we're probably going to rush as much ability haste as we possibly can. Which means we're going to delay on the Sheen for a little. Um, but then we'll be going for Lucidity, Kindle Jam, Warhammer, and all that stuff. We're going to be, like, speedrunning the highest, like, stacks we can have on Nasus in the game. We can scale the hardest. He's got no mana. There you go. He's got him. I got my TP. Time to stack up a little. Hopefully we don't lose this one. I'll stack up the cannon instead. Yep. Got it. I'll be slow pushing the wave very, very slowly. The bigger the wave is, the stronger we're going to be. And if I slow push the wave, I can stack it. And then like first item that we are going to buy is probably going to be Lucidity Boots. Because it allows me to stack fast. But we also have the choice of going Kindle Gem. We'll see what we do. Not sure. Oh, he tried it. <laughs> nice. He win those. Stack it up. He's likely going to barrel when I... Yep. Now we've got to be a little careful because it's very likely that the jungle is here. Nope. Spot him. Good to know. Let's get some stacks again. This time we're gonna be focusing on shoving out the wave as hard as we can. Make sure to stack the cannon if you can, guys. Gives you more stacks. And now we go back. All right. Yeah, first, uh, first things first, we're gonna go lose city boots. The reason why is because you gain movement speed and you also have the uh, spell haste. Also, you have the ability haste for your Q. So, the more ability haste, the better. For like, for like 950 gold, you will have 20 ability haste. That's really good. And the fact that your ghost is also reduced on cooldown makes it also better. And the next item we buy after is likely going to be a Kindle Gem because it makes us more tanky. Gives us more ability haste. And then we go Warhammer into Sheen. this one here. All uh, right, quick question. Do you ever go tier on Nasus? No. You don't need tier. If you run Biscuits on the secondary, you actually gain a lot of uh, mana back already. You don't need tier. He's got no mana, or barely has mana. Stand out the wave a little. Nice. Doesn't matter if I get hit. It's fine. Stuff like two pots. I got my TP. This gangplank is not running TP. He's actually running ignite. Stack up. He's getting a lot of Qs and barrels in. But that's fine. He's got no mana so he doesn't beat me here. See you later. 
still have my ult. We don't have to use that. Now, instead of like going back to base now, I'm just going to keep on stacking um, because I have my TP. If I keep stacking this up, I'm, I can get as many stacks as possible and still have full mana when I go back. So we're just stacking. I like the attempt from Gangplank to try and kill me, but the whole wave was being set up for Remus. Of course, I missed out. I got 111 stacks at 7 minutes in the game. Nice. He's probably going to try and stop me here. Thank you for the stack. Appreciate it. I'm going to poke him with my E. Ooh. He does damage. Let's go back. Alright. Now we're going to... I want to get my Sheen already. I think if I get my Sheen early, I can probably beat him. I'm going to try it out. He does not have Ignite, so I should be able to win. Yep, here we go. Thank you. I very appreciate it. And now we just shove out the wave. Likely what I'm going to do is just get one plate and then we go back. I'm going to max my W even though it doesn't fully work against Gangplank. I'm still going to do it. Let's get it real quick. Just one. Yeah, perfect. Now we go back. It's time we get my Kindle gem. We need more. We need to become more tanky and also have more ability haste. Nice. From time to time, you're going to find yourself in matchups on Nessus where you don't necessarily need to go TP, right? If you are in a very hard matchup or a matchup where you need to scale, you go TP. Um, but if you're in a relatively easy matchup, that's where you go Ghost and Flash. Like these two some spells, Ghost and Flash will make you make you much more aggressive, where TP is much more safe, but it does allow you to scale faster. Because you can TP back to lane, you can decide to stay if you want. You can't actually do that if you don't have TP. I don't think he has any wards, I doubt it. Nice. Yeah, of course he hits that, no problem. This guy does damage, man. He's gonna die. Good luck to him. Hey, yep. Got him. Now we stack up again. And we also make sure we stack the cannon. Two hundred four stacks, ten minutes in. Gotta make sure we shove out the wave fast, though, because we don't have any mana. If we decide to overstay, then Gangplank can uh, force the lane back into me. Yeah, let's go back. So now we go for Warhammer, and I will also sell my Revealable, just so I can buy it. Nice. Or, I may not even have to do it. Nah. Never mind. Got my Ghost back. I believe uh, Gangplank still has Ignite. Um, but if I go for all in against him, I should be stronger than him. He shouldn't be able to beat me even when he presses R. 
So if I all in right now, I will win. Here we go. Thank you. Even taking damage from the tower, no problem. Wait. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, like one Q did like half the HP bar from Talia. All I had to do was hit two Qs. And that's it, man. I can sell my Dorn shield and then buy to find. I'm kind of considering it because. Uh, nah, never mind. I'm not gonna sell it. I've been considering it. It's not that bad actually. The past is a tapestry of what lies ahead. Alright, here we go. Obviously, this guy is going to shove the wave out. He's got the damage for it. He's got a sense reaver. He's got it pretty early, man. I, he actually finishes his item faster than me, and I'm actually ahead of him. Nice. Uh, Talia could be here. Stacking is so easy to do at this stage, guys. Full stacks. Nice. Thank you. Stack everything. And now we get some plates. I'll get the last plate too. Yeah, perfect. Yeah, I'm doing way too much damage with my Qs. <laughs> I already have like 300 stacks 40 minutes in. Nice, clean. And we also stack the tower. Appreciate it. Oh, apparently this guy knew. Ah, there's more people here. He's dead. Let's get my Define, and then we start building a uh, Stone Plate. And now we TP back in top, and I'm also going to get the Red Trinket along with a Concha Ward. Watch this. And back to stacking. Pre stack, thank you. We almost have 400 stacks at 15 minutes. We're getting there. But yeah, this is how Nasus players do it. This is how you get a lot of stacks. You just uh, speed run the ability haste in the game. That's how people get insane amount of stacks early on. You also make sure you stack up the cannons. Because they give you the most. And then when you split push and you take jungle camps, you gotta make sure you stack the camps itself. He's dead. Nice. Then we go for the this thing real fast. Stack up everything we can have here. 
We stack up the uh, this one. And then we stack the wave up and then we go back. Of course, Jin's got to be here. We have my teammates coming here. So I'm not alone. We have nearly 500 stacks at 17 minutes in the game. Ah, uh, doesn't matter if I get hit. Now we go back. Got no mana anymore. Okay. 500 stacks at 17 minutes. I can delete people with two Qs. Hmm, I got another Q ready. Hmm, I need to stack up the cannon. Now we go back. Alright, let's get my stone plate. And the next item is probably going to be a frozen heart. Into their team comp. Uh, let's take armor. You know what? I'm just going to TP top because I don't care at this point. I'm way too strong. I'm bombing kills now. Stacking wards. Um, there is three people top. So I'll respect him for now. Unless. I got him. Yep. Even more kills. They tried two versus three-ing us. They failed because y'all know how Nessus works. Uh, I need to get the stack in the on the jungle camp. Good. And then we farm the wave. Perfect. Oh. Did that barrel show me? Hmm, I need to get this one. Oh man, I'm so strong. 600 stacks before 20 minutes in the game. You can't have it better than this, guys. This is like the most stacks you can have around this time. Maybe a little bit more if you're truly dedicated. Because I still don't stack everything. But yeah, that also means that obviously you can't pressure the game anymore if you're willing to get more stacks. You can stack faster, but you, that means that you're gonna, you shouldn't be helping your team anymore at that point. You're just stacking queues which makes no sense so like we are actively pressuring the game and stacking at the same time it's like the best thing you can do let's go back to late Stack more. Next wave. I'm gonna stack it all. Got my TP in 20. My Q now does over a thousand damage. Feels like no damage. Oh. <laughs> we got to flash that easily. Okay, sure. Appreciate it. Hmm. 
Seems like we got some company. Hey, Kaisa. Thank you. Thank you. Nice attempt at like trying to one versus four this. I also got a blue buff. Seven hundred stacks, twenty two minutes in. Yeah, perfect. And let's stack the wave up. But yeah, this is how you pressure on Nessus and stack at the same time. Hey. Okay, we have 800 stacks at 23 minutes in the game. Perfect. Let's go back. We get my frozen heart and then uh, we probably get Dormel. Nice. And then we TP again because as you guys know, I don't care anymore at this point. I'm just TPing because I can. And we do the same thing all over. Let's get the red buff. And back to lane. He doesn't even do any damage anymore. probably baiting. Yeah, he does. Thank you. Thank you. I highly doubt that they want to find me, man. Like, I don't think they're, 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 they're testing me out here. I don't believe them. I truly don't. They're pretending like they all in me, but they don't all in me. They don't do any damage anymore. Oh, well, seems like my Riven's cleaning it up. Hmm. Okay. Very well done. Stack this up. And then we move. Well, let's take the tower. That's fine. Almost 1,000 stacks at 25 minutes in the game. Uh, let's run up to the jungle. No. Oh, they surrender. Hey, the way. That's the top. Thanks much for watching today's YouTube video, and I'll see you next time. Peace.